What's going on guys, Garrett here, and in this video, we'll be covering Heist DLC and things that we know thus far about this awesome DLC coming very soon. As you guys know, Heist are right around the corner, hopefully you guys are excited. But in this video, we'll be covering everything that we know about the Heist DLC thus far. Now, Rockstar is still in the process of releasing new information, so hopefully there'll be more things to tell us about, because as you guys know, in the past few days they released new free mode stuff we'll be doing, new game modes, and much more. So with that out of the way, let's jump into what we know thus far about the Heist DLC, and here are some awesome things that you may not even know about that you should know. Starting off with Heist DLC, or to conduct a heist, you will need GTA Cash to set up and organize the heists. In addition to this, you will also need three friends, including yourself, because heists are a four-player mission. I don't know if you guys knew that. It is a cooperative team effort. You will need friends, crew members, whatever the case may be, get some friends, play some heists. I know it might be hard to find friends, but leave your gamer tags down below. I'm sure you guys can find somebody in the Java's Gamer family to play with. In addition to this, you must be level 12. Now, level 12 is a very easy level to get to. Hopefully, all of you guys watching my videos are higher than level 12. If not, there's some very easy ways to get level 12. Do some missions, do some races, do some death matches, or just play the game, and you will get to level 12, I'm sure, in a few hours' time. Because level 12 is a very easy level to get. Now, there will need to be a heist leader for every heist. You'll be like, Garrett, what is a heist leader? Well, a heist leader is someone that will have to set the objectives, and he or she must be the person that has the most money, technically. Now, the highest leader will have certain things that they will need to achieve before applying to be the highest leader. They must have a high-end apartment. A high-end apartment is an, an apartment with a 10-car garage. Again, they must be level 12, and they must have enough money to start a heist, as the lowest starting amount for the heist might be in the hundreds of thousands. Yes, you heard that correctly. Now, we're not sure how much heist will be paying out, but we know it's in the upwards of the higher thousands, maybe $600,000, $700,000, the payouts for these heist finales. And the heist leader does not get paid at all for the heist missions, only at the end at the finale. So let's say you fail all these heist preps, let's say you fail the heist finale, there's a chance the heist leader might lose their initial investment to start the heist. So you want to be very, very rich if you decide to be the heist leader. Next up, there will be 20 heists with five heist finales. With every heist finale, there are four heist preps. So you're gonna prepare for the heist, and then you'll do a heist finale, which will make five missions for each heist. There are a total of five heist finales. With that, there will be a ranking system for heist preps and finales, bronze, silver, and gold medals will be awarded, and this is leaked information that we know thus far from that point of view and basically how fast you can do them how quickly you are able to achieve a certain aspect of the heist if you did it stealth if you did it you know guns blazing whatever the case may be there are different medals that will be awarded to you sort of like achievement points and we're going to see if that affects our job points and it will be using job points to start up heist we don't know 100 percent information on that yet but there will also be new clothing added like masks gloves hoodies jackets bandanas boots um caps and much much more so that's pretty cool that's coming with the heist dlc next up we have brand new vehicles coming with the heist dlc and as many of you guys know there's a ton of awesome new vehicles coming like the lampity casco the dinka enduro we have the heavy insurgent the karen karuma the karen technical the principal electro and much more let me know in the comment section which car or vehicle you are most excited for and of course the hydra is in that list if you guys are excited for the Hydra, let me know in the comments section if that is the vehicle you're most excited for. And lastly, new gear will be added, which includes flares, night vision, thermite bombs, and much more. So we have new gear, new cars. We have new game modes coming like I, I covered the other day. We have new game modes. We have new free mode activities. We have new jobs. Um, as you guys know, there's uh, adversary modes. We got daily objectives, like a daily mission board, and more. And also on top of that, we will be getting... Um, Sort of like rewards that will be given for different things that you do in GT Online if you complete these missions. So you'll get like access to, you know, limited or exclusive Los Santos custom upgrades, t-shirts, and much more. So the heist are going to, it's going to be a huge update. Hopefully you guys are still excited. It is coming March 10th. It's going to be a great day for GTA Online. And of course, Rockstar has some major things planned after the heist DLC. If you think GT Online is gonna die after heist because there's nothing else you are 100 wrong 
because Rockstar definitely has a story mode DLC planned and they have many other things planned for the future to add more heists after these, uh, I guess, set of 20 missions are released. So hopefully you guys are excited. Let me know in the comments section what you are most excited about coming with this heist DLC. But overall, my name is Garrett. I'll see you guys later on today with a new video. You guys can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and or Instagram to stay up to date with everything GTA 5 and GTA 9 related. Make sure you guys let me know if you're going to PAX East, because that's where I'm going to be at this weekend. I'll be doing a meetup with the Saints fan, Mr. Boss of the Win, Expert Thief, Hike the Gamer, Typical Gamer, and Team Epiphany at the DX Racer booth this Saturday around 2 p.m. So if you guys are going to be at PAX East, make sure you guys be there. And I look forward to meeting you guys. But with all that said, I will see you guys uh, in a few days or tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow with a new video or later today with a new video. Make sure you guys check out my channel. Whatever. I love you. I am so excited for Heist. I, I, ah, I love you guys so much. Thank you guys. I'll see you guys later. Bye.